This local sports report is brought to you by Holistic Hockey. Sign up for specialty camps like high-performance elite skates, skills and scrimmages, or one of the three camps Holistic Hockey is offering this summer. Call Tyler at 519-501-2971 for further information or register online for any Holistic Hockey programs at holistichockey.ca. A full house in Tavistock for Game 6 of the Doherty Division Championship Series. The game completely sold out. The Braves looking to claim their first league title in franchise history. The Air Centennials, a.k.a. the Comeback Kids, hoping to force Game 7 back in air on Sunday. Game six, here we go. 109 into the hockey game. The Braves catching a break here. Angus Rowland from long range, Ryan Box. Wishing he had that one back. Tavistock taking an early 1-0 lead. Then midway through the frame, everyone left in the dark. As the lights go out in the arena, power was restored quickly. And when it was, John Ney, with a great solo effort, he breaks in. He stopped, but Brody Oliver is called for hooking on the play. So the Centennials to the power play, and they cash in right away away. Mac Kemp's point shot finding the back of the net and that was the start of a big night for Kemp. We are tied at one. Back come the Braves now. They work it around on the power play. Zach Berg continues to light the lamp in this series. He keeps scoring big goals. That's another one. Berg giving Tavistock the lead once again. It's 2-1. Later now, Tavi can't clear and it ends up on the stick of Mac Kemp. He's got himself another one. What a wild first period. The game is tied at two after 20. Second period, Braves goalie Jensen Van Bokel with a giveaway, but he gets back in his net and makes the save. We are still tied. Back the other way, Liam Odette with a break. Ryan Box a big save. Box led in a soft one to start, but he was solid the rest of the night. Third period, it's now three all. Reed Humphrey starting at his own blue line. And how nice is this goal? His celebration could use some work, but he gives Air the lead with a terrific goal. It is 4-3. Late in regulation, the Braves' net is empty. They have the extra attacker. This is Hudson Michaelis, and he seals it. The captain says, we will see you on Sunday afternoon. The never-say-die Air Centennials rally from a 3-1 series deficit to force Game seven, the Air fans were loud all night long and gave the team a standing ovation as they left the ice. 6-3 is the final in game six. The seventh and deciding game goes on Sunday afternoon at the North Dumfries Community Center. We wanted it more, and that's what it came down to at every game this series. Who wanted it more? And tonight, we all just buy it in. We happen to all buy in. Um, <clears throat> tonight, and the fans really played a big part of it tonight, too. Everybody coming down to Tavistock, it was amazing. It was amazing to hear when our names came over the uh, came over the speaker, and when we scored, just the building erupted even over on the road. We know how to win. We know how to turn the light switch on. But again, a bunch of new guys, younger. So it's about kind of breeding that excellence in. It's not about talent always winning, it's about chipping pucks out and starting from the back end, making our way all the way to the four, end, the, the four check and just going to work. You know, just kind of numb right now. Obviously, force in game seven is a pretty huge deal and we've had success. We're just looking to go back to our barn and ha continue the success, you know. It's, a, it's a been a great series so far and it's going to be a great game seven. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.